Hello, in this session, we are going to look at an introduction to Terraform Locals or we'll basically understand what Terraform Locals are. Now, Terraform Locals can also be used to uh, set your uh, variable and a value. So basically, you can use this local value to assign a name to an expression. So basically to a value and then you can start calling that local wherever you want within your configuration file so this way you can use the same name multiple times within a module instead of repeating the expression so maybe for example let's say you want to uh, set the tags for your uh, resources so instead of uh, setting the tags again and again the expression basically again and again and again we can make use of this locals to set that expression once and then we can start using that value which is setting the expression anywhere we want within the um, uh, configuration files. So if you're familiar with the uh, traditional programming languages, uh, it can be useful to compare the Terraform modules to function definitions. So we have your input variables which are like your function arguments. So we have already looked at your uh, uh, input variables that can be used to set certain uh, variables so if you don't want to hard code anything like the ami or the instance type or the security group id so if you want to if you don't want to hard code any of those values we can make use of your input variables then we have the output values which are like your function return value so at any point if you want to return some information or if you want to expose some information we make use of your output values and then we have your local values which acts like your functions temporary local variable so you can think of this as a local variable which we declare once and we can start using it multiple times within the configuration files right so terraform locals are named values which can be assigned and used in your code so these are also certain types of variables that we can declare uh, so we can set a variable name and an expression which basically specifies the value for that uh, local name and then we can start calling that anywhere we want within the configuration file so this mainly serves the purpose of reducing the duplication within the terraform code like i said for example let's say um, you are creating 10 resources now uh, for those 10 resources you want to set the tags now instead of having to uh, specify the tag expression for all the 10 resources one after the other that is um, 10 times we can set it as a local variable which we set it only once and then we can start calling that everywhere we want to set the tag so that way we are reducing the duplication of the terraform code so when you use locals in the code since you're reducing duplication of the same value you also increase the readability of the code so one uh, advantage that you have with this terraform locals is uh, you're setting it only once and you can use it multiple times which improves the readability of your code so in the future if the future maintainers are looking at the code the readability of the code will be much better and people will be able to understand um, what we are doing in that configuration files so local variables are blocks of code within terraform and this allows us to store static pieces of data that we might want to refer later or deeply dynamic pieces of data that can be manipulated by the state of your resources data sources and information provided by the input variables or other local variables so we can use this to store either static information or also dynamic information so maybe from your uh, resource block so uh, maybe calling your uh, uh, ami or the instance type from the resource block your data sources or other information provided by the variable blocks so all that information can be stored in the uh, locals and we can also store static information which is never gonna change so that is basically what your terraform locals are so this is another way for us to set the variables uh, which we can we can think of it as a temporary local variables and then we can start 
um, calling those variables everywhere we want within the configuration files. So that's an introduction to your Terraform locals. In the next session, we will look at an example of this. That's it for this session. Thank you. Once again, before you leave, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And if you like the video, leave a like and please share the video.